Good afternoon everybody, welcome back to Solinux Crypto and welcome to this update and new analysis on Solana today. Hope you're all doing great. In this video we'll take a look at Solana. It's um, The market structure right now you could describe it as boring, which it is. To be honest, I, I have barely traded Solana and have barely uh, taken a look at it. Um, but apart from that, it's, it's not only boring, it's also, it, it looks like we're getting close to a breakout. And I'll tell you why. I'll show you the market structure and just in general what you can expect out of it. It's, is it more likely to get a bullish breakout, more likely to get a bearish breakout? And we'll discuss that as well uh, while looking at some fundamentals. So that's what we'll do. Before we dive into Solana specifically though, if you want to receive daily trading signals, check out the links down in the description or the pinned comment, and there you'll find instructions on how to join, but also trade results, that type of stuff. Now let's get into uh, let's get into Solana. So as I said, let's talk a bit about the market structure first. So what you see right now is first of all, the EMAs, these waving lines, are are almost flat. They're trending down a little bit, but they're almost flat, which means the average price is flat as well. Um, which means, and you can also see that, that the price is moving sideways, right? That has been the case for the last uh, week and a half, at least. So now the big question is, is then, well, of course, if you're moving sideways, at some point you're going to break out. And uh, to make it even more interesting for you, what you see right now is that there's some sort of a, a downtrend, or you have lower highs coming from the top, and then you have higher lows coming from the bottom which creates sort of this triangle, right? Not not completely, I mean, you should draw it like this perhaps, uh, but this is what you get. This is the market structure. And we're going to get a bullish breakout or a bearish breakout, or we'll just continue the sideways movement, but even then, at some point, you're going to get that breakout. So altogether, the first thing we can take a look at is the market. What, what, what does Bitcoin look like? Well, it's moving sideways as well. So we're not getting a lot out of that. Well, you could argue that over the long term, we're more bullish, right? So that would, um, that would suggest that at some point we will be able to break above our main resistance level, which is in my eyes, 21.3, 21.5. All right, that's, that's kind of the level we are, we are in if you're assuming that we're moving sideways, something like this. Um, but apart from that, if you take a look at the fundamentals right now, to take that into the mix for Solana, uh, you can see that we're doing fairly well. Uh, the daily active addresses have been stable. They have not been going up that much, but all right. But the daily transactions are pretty good. They're around 27, almost 30 million today. Uh, or yesterday, excuse me. But that's a lot. Um, that's growing. Total value locked is right now around the same levels as it was the 21st of uh, March. Uh, but the big thing then was that the price was way higher. So right now we're almost at those same TVL levels, even though the price has dropped down significantly. So I would say there's actually more chance of a bullish breakout than a bearish breakout for Solana right now. So that's also what I expect, just given everything we know. I mean, if Bitcoin starts crashing now, Solana will follow it and we will drop down below our main support level, which is $20 and drop down to 18.5 easily. All right, that's not something I can predict. It's not something I expect, at least. Um, but on the other hand, right now, I think the most likely scenario is, given the market circumstances, but also given the fundamentals for Solana, is that we, at some point, will be able to break above that 21.3 uh, 21 level, take that break retest, and that we will get up to our main resistance level between 22.5 and 22.8. Um, so when that's going to come, I'm not sure. I, I, but I do think that at some point, I mean, this week, this week and a, the next week and a half, something like that is what I'm aiming for. Uh, but I'll keep you updated on that. Of course, I monitor closely myself as well. Uh, so keep an eye out for that. But for now, this is my analysis and my take on Solana. So thank you for watching. Take care and bye.